All right, I showed you guys this earlier when I had it taken apart, showed you kind of the breakdown of the Vassvarn M1911, right? So I wanted to paint it up nice, be kind of a candy paint red. I had to do a couple different things here. First, the candy paint that I use is not dark enough when there's graphics. So even if I clean it off with acetone, they just don't cover. So I had to go to a different red and then hit that red with the candy paint. And since I wanted to do a black tip here, I actually did some taping off so that we could have that black here. And it turned out pretty well. Um, not, I wouldn't say perfect, but very good. Definitely as good as the factory um, you know, jobs are on these type of blasters. So that's cool. So you can see here this barrel attachment, right? I did go ahead and glue on this one because there was no good way to affix it. This does have an extended inner barrel that reaches all the way into the gun and goes over the top of that interior barrel. So that helps with stability too. And then, you know, that's, that's pretty much it. I had put a larger capacity battery in here because this is the one where it just charges off the plug, right? So you can put another battery in here and it'll certainly work, but the battery that's in here is one where it charges and powers off this same plug, okay? It doesn't use this white plug. There's not even a white plug there. And I certainly could have rewired this, done another plug to the white set to this, and had a separate one. It was just easier to put the other battery back in there. It wasn't going to make any difference in FPS or anything anyway. So here it is, the 1911 from Vassvarn. We'll shoot it later, but I think it turned out pretty nice. So, all right, here we are with the Vassvarn 1911 or M1911 that I customized. Again, this is the one where you're going to go ahead and just plug it in right here to charge it. So the battery is internal. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and shoot it a little bit. I don't anticipate any differences in FPS. If any, it may slow down slightly due to barrel drag. Um, but otherwise, it should pretty much perform the same. It's more just a cosmetic, you know, upgrade, painted it out and put a different, uh, you know, extension there on the barrel. All right. So it's about 10 degrees outside. So you're going to get only inside shooting probably for a couple more months up here in Minnesota. about 120 on the FPS. All right, so that's where we're at with this. I do like how it looks though. I think it turned out really nice. And then I like how the, I was worried about doing a tape line, see how that would turn out, but I'm pretty happy with, with how it turned out. So Vassvarn M1911, I'm gonna actually just go ahead and include this as one of the options for you guys to choose in the January contest, right? So I got Desert Eagles, there's one other 1911 in there, so we might as well throw another 1911. So you got your choice of any of the Desert Eagles or 1911s, right? So you get to choose one from that and then any color, AKM 47. All right, so make sure you guys are entering the contest and getting all of those entries and please help with the referrals, the new subscribers. That's the best way to get the most referrals and then you got the best chance of winning.